What is this game? What happened to League of Legends, man? What is that? Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. All right, give me the draft you want. I know exactly what you're going to pick. You're going to pick some... You're going to play Senna Kalista. Maybe you're going to play Aritalia 1-2. Maybe you're going to play Aatrox 1-2. What are you not going to play, T1? Oh, no. Aatrox is banned, Zeus. What are we going to do now? What are we going to do now? Ze Aatrox is banned. Kalista, Senna, and Ash are up. Okay, which bullet do you want to avoid? Because they will play Kalista, Ash. Reverse big Senna. What do you play if they play Ash? If they play Kalista, Ash, Talia here? What do you play? Support? They're going to play Kalista, Renata. Cringe. Don't play Tom. Play like Wukong or Lee Sin. What else do they play? Nila? Yeah, maybe. Oh my god. Senatam, Kalista Renata. With their blind, Aatrox ban. Is it Kasante time? I don't know if it's Kasante time. I think it's Jace time. They should definitely ban Jace, maybe. Maybe they should ban uh, Oriana Nocturne. Mm, yeah, sure. I mean, what does Seus actually play? I don't remember. What would he play into, into Udyr? Nar Jace, I guess? Yeah, he'll play Nar maybe. Olaf? I don't think Zeus plays Olaf. Oriana Lee Sin. Ooh. I don't know. I don't like the way T1's comp is going. Maybe they can save it with like a last pick. Uh, a last pick Yone. Yeah, Jarvan is a pretty shit pick. Into Oriana Senna is good, but against Lee Sin, it's really bad. Are they going to play Jarvan Ari? That can do well, I think. Tristana, Tristana Sedge? Yeah, also good. What is it time for, Zeus? We've been cooking your last pick. Of course, it's TF top, you rat. Wait, chat, is Gumushi still undefeated on Senna? Uh-oh. Ooh, does Kalista, Sen does Kalista run out of win then, I guess? Okay, they took his blue, not bad. I mean, Leeson losing his blue is not that big of a deal. It doesn't really matter. 10-0? Wait, owner's Leeson is 1-4? Isn't that his best champ? How is he 1-4? Oh, nice flashes. Oh my god, Carrie, I missed Q. G was dead though. No, 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 it's his birthday! Oh, the shield! No, the cleanse Oh my god, just hit him! Why didn't Kalista just hit? Just hit him! Mm. Tristana has no W. Uh oh. You're not looking at your screen! Oh my god, Nongshim, you're win trading. You're win trading. This game is done though, isn't it? Just hit, Kalista, hit! Why is he just hitting? Maybe Tristana can solo kill Oriana here. Here, if he E's and now flashes forward, so just hit, hit, hit. He's level 4. I think he, I think he kills. With Q? Flashes on top of Oriana with Q. I think he kills him. Oriana has no spells. Chat, Oriana has no spells. Oh, he lost his flash. When did he lose his flash? Oriana Altos wind up is too long for Tristana. Kayla Blades with Q. Zeus, you're such a rat. I'm convinced Tristana can just jump on him. Oh, he's six on the way. Whoa, shit, that was scary. She has Halo Blades, man. Yo, sub me in. Ah, uh, kill that guy. Oh my god, he used Q to clear the wave. What the fuck? Why? Well, wow, it's really Operation Kill Faker, isn't it? Oh, now it's in, isn't it? Oh, he got him. Oh, he dropped the Q! Bro, I'm telling you, Tristana can one-shot Oriana. Oh, really lucky for owner that the E kills there. Otherwise, that Tristana is Audi. Man, this Tristana is getting blasted in lane. He had to go vamp step their first item. This Tristana can't walk up for a minion. Look, take the minion. <laughs> oh my god, this is brutal. This is brutal, man. Oh, Sylvie just queued and he has no flash. Guma has no W though, I guess, or what? Carrier! <laughs> Oh, the bailout. Oh, and Tristana's here now. Bro, Caria is so... <laughs> what is this Tam Kench? What is this Tam Kench? What the fuck? He's just 1v3ing them. What are they doing? They're walking up like they can kill the Tam Kench? 
What? Oh, they're bailout. Can he bail out from this big Tom Kench? Oh, he can't get them, Kerry. I can't get them. Mid tower got milked. Yeah, Faker is completely fed. Oh, what a reaction time. That's kind of hard to react to, I think. Especially with your, if your camera is positioned a bit further left. It can be a smaller than you think. Oh, Q. Ooh. He tried to go for the, the predict. Mid CS is tra tragic. Yeah, it's lucky Colney got a kill. Oh. <laughs> that just thought I just got one tapped. Just kicked him in the head. Roundhouse kick. <laughs> I think Sylvie tried to predict Faker flashing with face rush by going up. But yeah, Faker didn't really have anywhere to go, so I think Faker was also thinking about flashing up, but he didn't. But look at this, look at this Sejuani flash. I can stun him! Kill him! Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, I think Faker realizes here he can't go anywhere. And here I think he's thinking about flashing, but... Why does Sejuani KS, you rat? Oh, I need my night spell! Yeah, shut up. Oh, oh, you know it's fucked when Orianna can tank all of Tristana's EQ auto attack combo and just fight him, like fight back, just stand there and hit him. Like she just tanked his her whole combo. Like what? What? what, what, what? Ow! <laughs> Motherfucker took Knight's vow and he's leaning with Tristana. That's the only way to keep her in the game. Let me life steal on your Raptors. The Tristana mid says with 400 HP. <laughs> uh, hell no! <laughs> Well, at least he went Merc Trades on Tristana. That's a good buy. We all know Merc Trades are the buy. Merc Merchant. Hell yeah. We love our Merc Trades. We love our Merc... Oh, Zeus is dead. Faker. Yo, Dad, can you TP in and save me? Yo, Dad, help. Yo, Faker, please save me. Help! Faker! Thanks, Dad. Wait, what the fuck? Lil Bro also rocked up with the TP. His dad and his little brother came. Or big brother, I guess. Ooh, nice movement. It's time to take him on a journey. La 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 la. Wait, he's gonna execute. Ain't no way. Is Renata gonna flash here? Yeah, she can flash and get in range, I think, now. Maybe she can't. <laughs> oh my god. Some guy in the chat said touchdown. <laughs> what? You know what I think League of Legends needs? A good change that League can do. They should add treasure chests on the map. So like in the river, a treasure chest will spawn. And you have to fight over it. And it, the treasure chest can have like 100 gold in it. And whoever loots it gets the gold. Wait, Dota has that, really? No, but chat, I know Scuttle crabbed a treasure chest. But he's not a treasure chest, he's a crab. I want a treasure chest. I want to open it. Like a loot box. Gamba. <laughs> well, Faker's dead. Or is he? Help! Owner's coming. Owner! Yo, owner of the Sejuani. Help! Oh my god, the owner. Meanwhile, Zeus, I'm at a pay phone, trying to call. Just pushing side lanes. Classic. Oh no, never mind. He doesn't listen to Maroon 5 or whatever it's called, does he? He listens to Lady Gaga. No, he doesn't actually, but we, we, th we think he does. Ooh, chat, I got able another idea for balance team. What if Riot released a champion that was a support and his spells were items, okay? So think of Orn, but his spells are items. So level 1 Q is like... A cloth armor. Level level 5 Q, maxed out. It's like a Warmox. His W is like a longsword. His E is an amp tome. And his ult is uh, an Orn item. Artifact item that he can give you for 30 seconds. So he can give you items while you're fighting. And they only last like 20 seconds. Oh, a ruby crystal, 20 seconds. Longsword, 20 seconds. And then he puts points in the spells. And then he can give you like a... An IE for 20 seconds. A sick, a, a sick, a, a seventh item. He's he's called the item watchmaker. His name, the champion name could be Doran. That's genius. Oh, miss. Oh, 
Oh no. Oh no, the bailout's not gonna get a reset. Oh, the shockwave. Oh, Nongshim noodles. Uh, they're overcooked. Uh, they're soggy as hell. How is Zeus alive? Ow, he's not. He is. Well, T1. Man, I feel bad for Nongshim. It's happened every year. Every year, T1 loses like a regular season best of three or two regular season best of threes. And then whoever they play against next after they lost just gets the absolute biggest shafting session of their life because T1's mad. And they're like, okay, I guess we got to focus up again. But true, Nongshim's out. Why don't they just put their academy team in? I guess maybe it's not good because they can win the academy league. Just dive them, 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 dive them. Begging, 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 begging. Oh, do the thing. Do the thing with the kick. Do the thing with the kick owner. Do that thing. Oh, Faker went first. Faker went in first. Ooh, the Q from Zeus. Faker, are you fucking... <laughs> Ding! Ding! Faker, you're such a rat. What are you doing? Oh, what the hell that heal from Guma? <laughs> All right, Senna Ben, Maokai Vai, Kalista Ash, Oriana. Hmm. Is it time for Gumayushi Smolder? Or is it time for Gumayushi Varus? Because they lost and they're tryharding now. Oh, wait, Aatrox is open. Zeus, Aatrox is open. Are we gonna fucking 1 2? 1 2 Aatrox? You, what do you, what do you fancy? What about Aatrox Varus? So, what I've learned about Faker. If Oriana is open, he will 1 2 Oriana. If Oriana is banned, he will 1 2 Talia. If Oriana and Talia are banned, he will 1 2 Ari. Wait, owner, are you on Lee duty? Are you on uh, Sejuani duty, sorry? Wait, where's the Aatrox at? Where's the Aatrox at, bruh? Who oh dear, blind? Now, does T1 pick Varus or uh, or Aatrox on tree? Oh, Karma, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a, nah, Karma is trash. They do Varus on tree. Mm. They can just ban Lucian Zeri. And now Nongshim can ban Aatrox if they want. Aatrox TF or Jace Aatrox, I don't know. We need some 80 damage on T1. I mean, they're banning Nautilus because they want Zeri. But if you ban Zeri here, then I don't know what Nongshim's doing. Do you think he would be a good coach? I would hope so, but... Wow, they didn't ban Zeri? What the fuck? I think I had three teams this split asking me if I can help them in draft reviews. But obviously, I'm not going to do that. Why not? Because draft reviews are normally on the game day, especially. Like Saturday morning, for example. But I'm streaming on Saturday morning. I'm streaming on Saturday morning, Sunday morning, Tuesday morning, Thursday morning. What am I going to do? Just stop streaming and start drafting for people? Uh, of course it's Nar or Renekton, you little merchant. Bro, where's the vein at? Ah, uh, boo. Boo. I'm surprised they aren't playing Zeri. As much as Soldier's a good champ, uh, I think with counterpick support here, Smolder can get a bit blasted. Because I think the best blind here is Rel support. Oh, I think Smolder Melio is completely degenerate. I think they just play Rel into Alistar and then that's it. Or Alistar into into Braum, I guess. But oh my god, they went Smolder Melio. Is it a Blitzcrank game or what? Karma Smolder Melio? Come on, Carrier, lock in Blitzcrank. Caitlyn support is what the cast are saying. You think they would do Caitlyn support into this? I mean, they probably would actually. Rumble support. Ooh, he took a page out of Life's book. Oh, he's been watching FPX. He finally watched T1 Academy. I mean, T1 Academy were playing Rumble support with Reckless AD Carry, but FPX have been playing uh, uh, Rumble support with Varus. Uh, Life and Doc them with Milky Way have been playing a lot of Rumble. He's played seven games of Rumble support. He loves that shit. You go the Zaza Leandris. It's actually getting good success as well. They beat JDG with it. They 2v2 killed JDG bot lane. They were playing Kalista Ash. Ruler and Missing playing Kalista Ash. And uh, the Varus and the, the Rumble 2v2 killed and stomped them in lane. Yeah, he loves his Rumble support. I think maybe Karia watched FPX play. Well, Karia is just stacking up the unique champions, isn't he? Varus has TP as well to match. Oh my god. Karia played it at MSI last year. Did he play Rumble support at MSI? Oh, he did. Rumble 2022. Rumble MSI 2022. Why did he watch the Korean cast? Because it's hype as fuck. Okay, they just walked in and took owner's camps, and owner walked in and took his camps. Oh, Dundun, not a bad win rate. 4 and 6, considering they're 3 and 13. Whoa, what is that Udyr champ? Last time I was played was 4 years ago. 
Mia versus KT Tucson. What the fuck? Chat SP. Who the hell was SP? Oh, it was. Oh, it was. Was it APK Prince? Oh, uh, it was APK. Basically, Sandbox. Hmm. What is Jiwoo doing there? <laughs> if he gets level 3 here, Carrier, he can balance his heat a bit if he E's. And then he can just all in. I want to see the ru the rumble all in is strong here. You all in with the, with the overheat and you just one shot someone. Like, they need to be careful here in Yongshim all in on this rumble. This rumble damage on overheat is crazy. Why isn't the owner playing around bot? Oh, nice try. Faker didn't have any mana after that. But the owner needs to Q flash his flash there. Oh my god, rumble damage is crazy. Rumble damage is absurd. Look at smolder items. Yeah, it's not that bad, I guess. I mean, he just wants to get a Q up as much as possible. So having CDR, I guess, I get it. Run, Zeus, run! <laughs> Hope my team gets something for this, Zeus says. <laughs> Owner is so close to six. Bro, rumble support is really strong. Like, unironically, rumble support is mega strong. It's actually hidden OP, I think. They can't walk up against this guy. Oh my god. Look at Bot! How close to six is Carrier? Oh. oh, they're both dead. Bye bye, T1. Just get the tower. We're dead anyway, boys. Oh, we take one with us. Nope, the shield. Look at Rumble's damage. Like, it's crazy. Well, I guess they had the base eventually. Faker, playmaking maker. Carrier? You good, bro? Ah, oh, Lee Sin, no flash, dies of cringe. Where is Keria going? Where is Keria going? Farewell. Farewell, Mr. Karma. This motherfucker is tanky or what? Those mercs are doing work. Smolder has 70 stacks. <laughs> Help! <laughs> can he eat the war jump of Lee Sin? Oh, he can knock the kick. I mean, what more can Faker do? He's stuck. Oh my god, he's playing it well. Oh my god, he dodged Lee Sin Q again. What is happening? Holy fuck. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. Carry us back to Bully Dundon. Oh, nice kick. Dragon? Oh, Q miss. Yo, Faker can't get hit by Lee Sin Q. What the? That little rat. Uh. Carry doesn't have his Deandres yet. But when he does. Alright, Smolder has 117 stacks. Not bad, actually. That Smolder's not in that bad of a spot considering he laned 4v2. Literally laned 4v2. Is it boring to watch a one sided series? Uh, yeah, but. I mean, it's not boring, but it obviously is like less interesting. You know, you, not every series can be close, right? If every series was cl every series was closed, then they wouldn't be as exciting. Yeah. Too much of anything's bad. It's the games that are stomps that make you appreciate the games that are close. Oh, Zeus! Oh, he stole it. Oh, kick from Sylvie was clean. Wait. Nongshin went one for one and got Drake. What? How? 
How did they pull that off? They had four flashes down. Yeah, true, but still. Yeah, the Lee Sinult was really good. Good job, Sylvie. Mad, Mad Lions lost one minute ago, Kajul, and Nongshim's 10th. What does that say about EU? Shut up. Ooh, nice combo. That's a lot of stacks for Jiwu. Oh, Sylvie! Oh my god, that Sylvie! That Jiwu is yet. Happy birthday! Wait, he's getting so strong! Not that bad for a Nongshim. Udir wasn't even there. It was two for two. Crazy that they, they're 5k down, but they actually can win on a force a bit. They can kind of win on a force. I mean, Merc Treads are really good against T1. I mean, Merc Treads are really good. Uh, I think Lil Pup is close to 225. Very close. Like, Nongshim or Skalen. T1 have a lot of damage, though. They have a shit ton of damage. But Nongshim or Skalen. 2, 216. 218. It's gonna be what 223? Yeah, it's three stacks off. Dragon spawning and he has 225 on the next wave. Baker spacing no TP, so they can't force before it. But here it comes, 225 stacks. Boom, done. It's time, baby. Nongshim, this is the only fight you can win, I think. <laughs> Otherwise, if you lose this, it's done so. They're stuck behind the Talia wall. Steal by owner. Yeah, GG. I mean, Lee Sin's dying on one side, Udir's dying on the other. T1 can force Baron now and GG. Unless... Can Smolder stop Baron? Oh, that mantra Q hurts. Oh, Jiwoo. Oh, he wanted the he wanted the solo kill on Faker. I get it, I get it. Uh, Just fly over that wall, Jiwoo. Do it. Send it. Look at the Gnar! Uh-oh, Jiwoo. Jiwoo, get some balls. Go in there. Yeah, hell yeah. Get in there, Dwagon. Oh my god, they're all 1 HP. Oh my god, it's so unlucky. Faker's gonna kill him. Oh, he missed. Uh, come on, Jiwoo. Come on, you can get one of them. Come on, little Dwagon. Run, you rat. Oh, he missed. Oh my god, it was a penta waiting to happen. T1 is like playing with him. Bam, 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 bam. What is the caster saying? <laughs> oh, the wraparound. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, no flash on Call Me. Ooh, nice kick by Sylvie. Oh, carry a blast, come back. But maybe Smolder does... Oh, Faker's just gonna end. <laughs> la la la. Oh my god, this position is horrible for Nongshim. I think the worst game state losing is like when they're split pushing and you have to fight an objective. Come on, Jibu. Come on, Nongshim boys, don't go out like this. The dragon, the dragon. They're just gonna give Infernal Soul? Maybe Jiwoo thinks he can carry. He just needs items. But they have Rumble Varus with, with Infernal Soul. Ow. Oh. Jiwoo won't do shit. He isn't brave enough. I mean, what do you want to do? Fucking fly in as a dragon and just get one shot? I mean, he is getting pretty strong, though. He has 350 stacks or some shit. He is getting strong. But yeah, I mean, they have Infernal Soul. I think Infernal Soul is GG. Uh, it's the same position, trying to go towards Nash. Enemy team split pushing. Can't play. <laughs> this is just a screenshot right here. Zeus' split summed up in one picture. <laughs> good job, Zeus. We got Nash off that. Good job. Was good death. Actually, good death. It's a good strat. Make your top laner push till die, and then you get Nash when they go collapse on him. Don't look mid items. All right, I won't look mid items. Ah, uh, hell nah, bro. What the hell? How does owner have three items against Nongshin, but Lucid can't? 
키우면서 정말 한 방이 있냐 없냐 그냥 그 구도예요. 네. 거의 한 10분 때부터 지금까지 20분 이상 지우만 바라보고 있었습니다. 그렇죠. 키워는 계속 유리합니다. 네. 그렇죠. 단한 번도 그 구도가 아, 뒤집힌 적은 없습니다. 하지만 지우가 유리하다고 어이, 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 아우 지우! 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 Oh my god, what a monster! Su! He doesn't know what to do, he doesn't know if he should face or not. Just push, boy, push, get the towers. Wait, they were like 15k down. <laughs> Smolder. Smolder! What? How is that possible? Oh, it's an elder fight as well. Here it comes. An elder fight. Is this gonna come down to an elder fight or is Seiyu's gonna go for the back door? Because Nongshim's gonna force it. Faker's TPing in. Owner, it's a bit hard to smite the Sejuani against Lee Sin. Zeus is still pushing. Karma's TP. Kicks him away. Varus Guma stole it! What the fuck? How did Guma get it? What? How did Guma get it? Ain't no way! Chiwu! <laughs> They're still winning because they have Smolder! <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god, no! Chiwu, Chiwu, Chiwu! <laughs> what is happening? Oh wow! What a what a what a what a, what a nostalgic moment! What a throwback! Guma, can he steal it? No way! <laughs> Smolder is six items though, and T1's elders running off. They're still 10k up, but they don't. They're not, they're <laughs> Nongshim has one more Smolder than they do. Oh, they're gonna get Baron, but I guess it's fine. It looks like Nongshim didn't want to fight it anyway. I mean, it's pretty obvious how this game's gonna go. If Smolder Penta kills, they win. <laughs> what? If Smolder doesn't Penta kill, they lose. They're 12k up and they're struggling because of Smolder. It's actually difficult because of the, the, the enemy champion. Look at the burn damage, man. It's crazy. <laughs> Uh, Zeus has flash. Oh my god, the tower is gonna die. Guma might kill Dundun. Nah, no way, Dundun damage. Alright, they lost triple in the back. Chiwu, 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 Chiwu. <laughs> what is this game? What happened to League of Legends, man? What is that? Look at Karia's face, man. He's so fucking done. Yeah, he has a 15. Oh, what? This champ has a 15. What? 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 What is this design? It's pathetic. This is unreal. What does he sell? What item does 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 does, does the smolder buy? He should not sell boots, I think. Okay, thank god he didn't sell boots. Spear of Shojin. Yeah. Oh my god, he's still stacking that rat. Holy fuck, this is the strongest smolder I've ever seen in my life. I've never seen a smolder this strong before. He has 555 stacks. 560 stacks. 563. Like, oh, this motherfucker is strong. strong. Death had 600, did he? Well, I think we might make it 600, we'll see. It's funny how Nongshim's mid-jungle is fucking broke. Marasaka is lucid on, Lu on Lee Sin. He's gonna try and ultimate and get the melee ult out. Oh my god, that champion. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Look at this, this is Guma. Guma hurts. Oh, Zeus pushing. Udyr can't match him, I think. Wait, G was TP flanking this guy. Why? Why is G was TP flanking the Nar? They're gonna lose Elder. They're gonna lose Inib as well, anyway. Ding! <laughs> Boom. I guess maybe they can't push, and that's his logic. They'll only get Elder for a minute. 
But uh, that's scary, no? I guess, yeah, I guess Nongshim already have an Elder, so it just evens up the game. This Smolder is still power farming everything in the game. But surely Maths tells us that four Elders beat one Elder, right? Right chat, four elders beat one elder, right? How much gold does this smolder have in his inventory? All right, T1 are going to go Baron. That means they'll have 40 seconds of Baron, Elder, and Soul. Maybe 30 seconds. 613 stacks. <laughs> what? They have every buff in the game and a 12k gold lead. Surely they beat the smolder now, right? Right. They have every buff in the game. Red buff, blue buff, infernal soul, elder, baron. Enemy team just has a smolder. Right. right. Elders off in 10. Sejuani ults missed. Two seconds on elder, elders off. Oh my god, they're so scared of him. They are so scared of that smolder. They are so scared of it. <laughs> He's single-handedly holding the minute him. What? <laughs> they can't walk up and hit it. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> what? Look at Guma's HP! <laughs> what the fuck is this? What is this? What is this abomination? What is this abomination? They got an open Nexus. They got an open Nexus. Surely they can end now, right? Surely they can end. They've got an open Nexus. T1 just has to play the map. <laughs> what is this? Smolder chat. Absolute cinema. How many stacks does this motherfucker have? He has 6k gold in his inventory. <laughs> they got their second tower of the game. The smolder, the smolder effect. He has 680 stacks. He has 680 stacks. Oh, he's put, he bought, he sold his item, bought a pink, ran out of base, put the pink down, and then went back to base to buy his item again. Zeus has Moby boots! <laughs> it's so he can run into the base faster to backdoor. Isn't swiftness better? What if he gets hit in combat? Like Jiwoo can just proc combat and run him down, though. No? He's dead anyway. <laughs> True, he's fucked anyway. I think the only way Nongshim can get themselves out of this game now and win is if Sylvie steals Elder. I think there's no other way. He almost has 700. 18.5%? He's almost a 20% execute. <laughs> He's almost a 20% execute. Are they giving Elder? I think they're just giving Elder, aren't they? Oh, okay. They're not killing Elder yet, T1. Are they waiting for Baron? So T1 have so much map control that they're not killing the Elder yet. They're waiting for a Baron timer so they can get both. And they have a longer time to end the game. But this is giving Nongshim time to push out waves. I think they're not doing Elder on purpose. So Nongshim gets sucked into fighting it so they can TP behind them. Because look at Zeus. I actually think they're not waiting for Baron. They're hoping... Maybe they are also waiting for Baron, but they're hoping that Nongshim comes into fight so they can end. But they didn't come into fight. But now at least Nash is in 30. So now they can go Nash. Udyr swept. He must have swept it. Yeah, he did. Oh, Jesus. He's swept the ward. That's big. Alright, now they can go Nash and have Nash and Elder same time. I mean, Talia can ult in their base, right? And Nar can run down. They have so many ways into their base here. Oh my god, man. Smolder is gonna murder them. But they need to be really careful of Faker just going for the Nexus. T1 can't do Baron, it looks like. But they need to. They need to do Nash now. They need the Baron. Oh my god, the Elder's gonna fall off in a minute 30. They won't have a wave to play on. They have an open Nexus though, but T1 cut. Like, T1 are afraid to run into their base. They're 13, 12k up. They have Soul, Elder, Nash, but they're afraid to walk into the base. They're actually scared to walk into the base. But they have to. They, how else are they going to end? Nongshim's never contesting anything. They're just standing in base. You can't fake it. Oh my god, that smolder is a psychopath. Oh, Kerry is dead! He's dead! 
Oh, he didn't get the queue off. Oh, is he dead? Oh my god! What a shot from Guma! Holy fuck! Bang! One arrow ended the game. Oh my god, that was sick. That was so cool. Wait, that, wait how cool was that? That was crazy, actually. Just one arrow, bang! Just killed him. Holy fuck, and then he just walks away. <laughs> oh my god, Guma, that was sick. The Dragon Slayer Guma Yushi.